Hey everybody, this is Ernie Hatmaker, and I'm just coming out to survey what happened after Laura came over last night. Um, we had three tornadoes in our area, a lot of wind. It came out after all of it was over and set up some of my um, containers. And I come out this morning and yeah, I gotta pick up some more again. So let me show you real quick what's going on with the containers and then I need to pick them up before things start crawling into them. For those tomatoes there they're leaning over onto the table see a couple snails have crawled up onto the morning glory something ate some of them um the fish were covered except for the really big one and he got a lot of fresh water i hope he didn't jump out of there i don't see him swimming in there he had to get moved because he was eating his little brothers uh yeah that's our uh, peppers some more tomatoes and they were top heavy anyway um, yeah lots of stuff falling on other stuff they've fallen into other things and I do not like that at all because when they fall into things the critters that were just on them are now on everything else Oh goodness, some of my yellow pear tomatoes have fallen. Alright, I guess I better get started. They don't even belong over there in those rocks. They actually have a place right here. Right in front of this one. In front of this one, that bucket should have been in. The bucket had to have been either tossed that way and rolled because it all there's a lot of little tomatoes in the rocks. Those are tomatoes, the green dots all in the rocks. None of my lemon starburst peppers fell off, but a lot of the uh, the yellow pear tomatoes did. The lemon starburst are on this side of the plant and the yellow pear tomatoes are on that side and a lot of them fell off and you know they're green. This guy, uh, I'm probably going to have to fix him up a little bit. Um, he has completely come out of the dirt. fix that right now. Not without getting down and dirty. I've got other stuff to pick up. On the plus side, these beans that I put in here when I didn't think any of my squash seeds were coming up right after the melon left. They're coming up. And now there's also a butternut squash coming up in there. That's kind of funny. But yeah, all that green, the beans came up on that side. And the beans were dug up on that side. Funny, funny, funny. I was picking up this basil here. And all of that just came out of it. And I almost got my hands on them. Um, yeah, it's like the wasps found somewhere to escape the... Torrent. I guess one of their nests was knocked down. Yeah, I just had to lurch out of one of their way. Oh my gosh. That was kind of scary. <laughs> I might need some help. This is all a pretty jumbled up mess right now, but it's coming down on me again, so I'm gonna get out of here.